This is an NTE U106 automatic programmable rotor with wireless remote control. Motor mounts out on the roof. It's an arrow on the body of the rotor and an arrow on the turning part of the rotor, which is pointed to the north front of the antenna. It would also point to the north front of the antenna. Is the side of the antenna with the shortest elements or where the wire attaches to the antenna. U clamps hold onto up to a two inch mast. A little stop that prevents the, bar, the rotor motor from sliding down the mast. You'd remove that if you are using a TB105 uh, alignment bearing for extra support. You mount the antenna approximately three feet or less above the top of the motor. It will also hold up to a two inch mast. Um, three conductor rotor wire inside this bottom of the rotor. You get at it by opening the bottom and attaching the three conductor rotor wire one, two, three. Uh, I usually attach black to one, red to two, green to three, but it doesn't matter as long as you match what you've attached to one, two, and three onto the control box as well. Programmable box sits on top of the TV. With this unit there are 12 different positions that you can program in. To program you turn to where the strongest signal for a particular channel is and then you push the memory button in the place you want to store it. It'll be stored and then you go on and do another channel. The similar control unit has the same functions as the control box, the wireless remote control. And after you've programmed in the positions A, B, C, and up to L, then you can write on the back of the control what channels are at that position. There may be several channels at that position. This is an NTE U106 control box available at starkelectronic.com.